Well, good day, model railroaders. On one of my live streams, I brought out four locomotives that were brand new, just sent to me, and was going to run them on my layout. I have the NCE 5 amp, 5 amp system, and for some reason, when we got them on the tracks, they'd make sound, lights would turn on, but I couldn't make them move. So here's a brand new locomotive that I've had for a while, but never out of the box. So I'm going to do the same thing, program it to number three, and see what we can make it do on this system. Now remember, it's the NCE 5 amp system. So let's get number three programmed in there and see what it'll do. Okay, so for Inner Mountain's new locomotives, you got to select loco number three. Did that. So it starts up. Bell button works. Headlights I cannot turn on. Horn works. So we know it's communicating with the decoder. Just moving up on the speed dial. And nothing's happening. Go a little bit faster here. Okay, all the way up to 126 heat steps. Alright, so the system's not communicating with address number three to make it move anyway. So let's try something else. Okay, so we got it programmed to address three for the new locomotive for Intermountain. You can still hear the spitter valves going, so we know we got power. I am going to program this to the engine number four number address. So that's 3393. So we're going to go to program on the main. Program loco 003. Yes. We want to do the address. We want to put in a long address. And the address we're going to do is 3393. Enter. All right. So now it's sitting ready for address 3393 so let's see if we can make it move hold on okay so we got a program for local 3393 and we start it up hit the belly in Hit the horn. Let's do the headlight. That actually came on. You guys can see that. So we have a little more control now that we've put the four number address in there. It doesn't move. And we have movement. Okay, guys. So what's that telling me? Well, that's telling me that my 5 amp system has too many locomotives programmed with address 3. And I've tried to run them too many times. So what do I need to do for that? Well, I need to clear the memory of my 5 amp system. So I'm going to show you guys how to do that. Hold on. Okay guys, so what I'm going to do is actually reset the 5 amp command station. And to do this we have to hit program escape five times. One, two, three, four, five. Set command station it says. Now we're going to hit enter 16 times. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Display will now say reset system, which it does. Press 6 for yes. Are you sure? Press 1 to confirm. There we go. Now, let's see what that's actually done to the system. Okay, so when you get the system back, it says hit enter one more time, brings you back up to the first screen, select local number three. So, we're gonna hit select local 3393. Three. Start it up. Waiting 
forward. So we haven't affected anything that we've programmed, and that's good. And you're normally programming decoders anyway, not the system. So let's find a locomotive number three and see if that helps out with that. Okay guys, so we got an Atlas Gold Series. This is one of the Ontario Southland Railways, so it's a limited edition. I had to unscrew it from its container, so I know it's a brand new one. And it's got track power, it just made a sound. So that's a good thing. So we're gonna hit locomotive three. We're gonna hit start up. And the system did this last time. We got a bell. We got the horn. I like the horn on that one. We didn't get a headlight last time. Oh, but we did this time. Locomotive number three. Can we get movement? Awesome. So there you guys go. NCE 5 amp power system. If you're having problems with your locomotives that are on number three, all you gotta do is reset your system. So, go back in the video. When we did that live, well, I was live, you guys are watching a video, duh. But resetting the system, because you're uh, doing decoder programming, the addresses you're setting go right to the decoder. But when the system's acting up, just do a system reset. Then you can go back, you're getting new locomotives on engine uh, number three for the decoder again. You can still check them out. Why the program for number three, make sure everything's working properly. That way if it's not, you can take it back to your retailer that you bought it from, or you can do some troubleshooting beforehand. And then just reprogram the decoder if it's working great, and things are going good. Okay guys, so that's how to reset the NCE 5 amp system. I'll go over it one more time for you. That way it's just kind of a quick reference right here at the end of the video. And probably doesn't hurt to actually do it every once in a while anyway. But as soon as I get done that, I'm gonna go run my new trains that I gotta. All right, bye for now guys. Okay guys, just a quick recap for the NCE 5 amp power system, how to reset it. Turn it on, press program, escape five times. Press enter 16 times. Display will say, reset the system. Press six for yes, and then press one to confirm. And that resets the whole system. Now you're good to go. It's like a brand new system again. All right guys, I hope this video was helpful. And if you ever do run into this kind of a problem, even if you're not having it now, well, this video is here for you. So take care, have fun, and go run some trains. Bye for now.